Today I'm going to be talking about a famous author called Roald Dahl. Roald Dahl is a famous British author uh, and he is known for making many books. But I only have two of his many books. Books. So I would like to read you one of them. This one is my favorite. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. I also have another one which is called Fantastic Mr. Frog. Now let's get to reading. The main character in this book is Charlie. Charlie Bucket. Wait, a bucket? Is it a type of bucket? Good morning. Today I'm going to tell a story of Fox and the Grapes. One on a hot summer day, a fox wandered across the jungle in order to get some food. He was very hungry and desperately in search. My favorite book is the 365 Bedtime Stories. My story's name is The Miser and His Bag of Gold. Once upon a time, a miser was traveling by a ship. He had a big bag of gold. He didn't want to let it go. Suddenly, the ship got caught in a storm. I will tell about the lazy servant. Once upon a time, Birbal and Akaba was in the garden. Akaba, Akaba tell to Birbal. Look at this lazy servant. He is not working very hard. He is just resting under a tree. And I will get him fired. And Birbal said, No, your majesty. I will make him... I will make him... Work. Good morning to all. I am telling a beautiful story about always sharing. John was a selfish boy. He never John was a selfish boy. He never shared his toys with anyone. His parents tried to teach him about kindness and sharing. One day, John was returning from his school with his new bicycle. As John was watching, a boy fell into the ditch. He cried, Ah, I can't move my arm. John, Friends, good morning. My name is Sajwa Mahri from 30A. I am going to tell about a short story. Big Carrot A rabbit and a squirrel were from Good morning to all. Today I am going to tell you a story. The story name is Who is Happy? Once a crow looked at a swan and thought, How beautiful the swan is. She had all white feathers. The crow expressed his thought to the swan. The swan replied, According to her, the What's a mouse accidentally fell on a sleeping lion? The lion lost his sleep. A crow looked at the swan and thought, How beautiful the swan is! She had all white feathers, whereas the crow was black. The dove thanked the ant for saving her life. And they, and they become friends forever. Moral of the story is, one good e, one good deed deserves another. Thank you. I'm going to read one of my favorite and I like it.
I like it. Shake on the train. Shake Chile was four years old when he sat in the train for the first time with his father and mother.